We're excited to welcome baby June into the world, but with, long all, with all that excitement comes a whole lot of stress. Kids are expensive, and as their dad, it's my responsibility to ensure little June has a secure future. I'm not just a real, Norfolk real estate dad, I'm also a Norfolk real estate investor who believes in, in wealth accumulation through real estate assets. And here is what we did. My wife and I purchased one income property for each of our four children. All of these properties have positive cash flow and cover things like braces, post-secondary education, money for a down payment on a house, or just help out with any other direction our children decide to take in the future. You know what the most relaxing thing in the world is? Not having to worry about any of that. What if you bought just one house and all it did was break even each month? I'm gonna do some boring math, but stick with me. It gets exciting. So take the average home in Southern Ontario. Over the past 30 years, it appreciated approximately 5% per annual. Okay, now we take the rule of 72. You can Google that if you'd like. The rule of 72 tells us that if you have 5% appreciation annually on your home, then in approximately 14.4 years, your home will double in value. The average home in Norfolk County in 2010 was $200,000. The average home today in 2019 is now over $350,000. That is over a 75% increase in just nine years. Now, imagine if you waited 25 years, you pay off the whole home. In roughly 25 years, you should have approximately a $1 million piece of real estate completely paid off. What would a million dollar asset mean to you in retirement? And just because you're in your 40s, your 50s, or your 60s, it's never too late to start building wealth for the future. I know what you're thinking. You know, this sounds really easy, but you probably don't think it's possible for you. Or maybe you're thinking, man, I don't have the time to find, figure out, buy, rent, and then hold this property forever. When we started looking for our first rental property, my wife was pregnant with our second child. We were just celebrating our first child's first birthday. We had just moved 4,000 kilometers across the country. I started a new career and we only had $7,000 in our bank account. We knew we were not saving enough to take care of our kids and still retire someday. We saw that inflation was outpacing our average wage increases here in Ontario. We needed to find a better way to create wealth and give our family the future options that we wanted. The difference between us and anybody else is just that we took action. I spent years and countless hours reading books, listening to podcasts, talking to different people and learning how to do what we do. It wasn't the most fun thing I could have been doing with my time, but man, it was worth it. Now you can go and spend countless hours trying to do, figure out and do the same thing, or you could talk to the Norfolk Real Estate Dad. Hi, I'm Nick Thompson, the Norfolk Real Estate Dad. And I wanna help you make responsible real estate decisions to help build wealth for years to come. So if you're looking to get some fatherly advice, click on that link somewhere around this video and let's get started. Every journey starts with just one first step. So go ahead, click the link.